Okay, the problem with this is that this burner right here is not regulating. You put it on low. And the burner stays red hot. So you cannot regulate the temperature of this burner. So I'm going to replace this infinite switch right here because this is what controls the amount of power that is delivered to the burner. By replacing this, we'll fix this problem and it will regulate properly. I've turned the breaker off. And I've confirmed that we have no power to the range. So we are just going to remove this back panel here. This is the infinite switch right here. I'm just going to swap these wires out on the new infinite switch, wire by wire, wire to make sure that we get the right wires on the right connectors. It's a good idea to always take a picture of it before you do so, so you can make sure you get them on the right way. We're going to replace a GE WB, WB24X10025. And if you want to know how these infinite switches work, there's a link to my website that goes into great detail about that in this video description. Okay, I'm just going to swap these wires one by one here. I'm going to take each wire off and put them on their respective terminals. I can't hold the camera while I'm doing that, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I've got all the wires on there the way they were, and you can also look at the other infinite switches and compare them to make sure you have the wires in the right place. I'm simply going to put the switch back in. Okay, you got the switch in place. I'm going to go ahead and put the back on and test it out. Turn the power back on. I turn it on three. This is the burner in question. I'm going to monitor the temperature. Before it was reaching uh, over 700 degrees on two or three. Now it's hovering around 250. It's probably going to go up to about 350, 350 maybe at the highest. So it is now regulating. So that's what it was. That was a problem with the burner not regulating. It was that infinite switch right there. For electrical and electronic educational content for appliance technicians, go to techcircuit.org or subscribe to this video channel. Thanks for watching.